Okay. We're going to take the uh, pressure cooker. There's uh, eight jars of tomato sauce in the pressure cooker. We let the steam go. Get all the steam out of there. Cook up another four to eight jars. As you can see, the steam is rushing out of there. We steam uh, in a steamer for 15 minutes, each jar, and then we uh, we'll let it cool off outside. It comes out about 280 degrees, and we put it outside on the rail, let it cool down for about eight hours, and we pack it away, and has a life expectancy probably about close to, well, I would say maybe a year to two years. You can see all the steam is going down. Once all the steam gets out of the pressure cooker, this little nozzle in the back will go down, be able to open it up, take all the tomato sauce out of there. It's almost all down. Just on that little cap. Tomato sauce, you got to steam. All the other most of the other vegetables you can put in a hot water bath. The reason because of that, because of the acid in the tomatoes, and you got to put a little uh, lemon juice, a very small amount of lemon juice in each, each jar to offset the acid. So we're almost done. And as you can see, it's going to be really, really hot. We'll go down soon. And once that little level goes down, we can remove it. Kids are coming over today for meatballs and spaghetti. Homemade meatballs, homemade sauce, homemade spaghetti. Pat made it all. Pat's a good Italian cook for being an Irish woman. So, let's get this down. Now it went down, you can open this up, really, really hot. Got our little grabber. Almost 300 degrees and they go outside. 